$2.10. That's the national average for a gallon of mm -hmm. gasoline, according to GasBuddy.com. All right, prices at the pump, they're the lowest we've seen in five years. So why are so many Pennsylvania drivers so unhappy? Pittsburgh's Action News 4 reporter Shannon Perrion joining us live with the answer. Is it we just want to gripe about something, Shannon? We have to, Wendy. We have to complain about something. You know, it's a cold night to fill up, and you really don't mind so much when prices are this low. We haven't seen prices like this since 2008, 2009 here in Pittsburgh. Uh, they're a little bit higher, though, and that's what people are upset about. Well, people here are kind of celebrating. The rest of the country is having the party of the century. Pittsburgh area gasoline prices are awesome. Two forty nine, two thirty nine, even a dollar ninety. Hold up, wait. That one dollar and ninety cents is not in Pennsylvania. It's in Ohio, just across the border. Yes, I have a lot of friends who live out there. One ninety nine, one ninety eight in some places. The highest I think I saw it in the last month out there was like two dollars and ten cents. What's the lowest you've seen? Out there, 194. What gives? The look across the country shows ours is just one of seven states hovering above 232 a gallon on average. Enter PA's brand new 10 cents a gallon tax being phased in now, created to pay for crumbling infrastructure. Some know why it's so high. Because of the taxes. But the bridges need it. You have to go with the, you, know, you can't let the bridges go to, or we wouldn't be driving at all. They also know Pennsylvania is a special state with special challenges. And I think the, the PA tax is probably too high, but I'm aware of the fact that we have more roads and more hills that damage the roads because of the water compared to Ohio. Still, it just doesn't seem fair to some drivers, even if 239 is a far cry from the 405 we've paid in the past. So the middle class and the lower class people can't afford all this ridiculous raises. And there's no reason it should be that high. Absolutely none. You guys need to wake up and realize that not everybody's super mondo rich. Well, just think about that next time you fill up in Pennsylvania. The more you pay, the more of those back burner projects, those roads that really need to be tackled in Pennsylvania, are going to be fixed. And also keep in mind, we don't have the highest gas taxes in the country. We were behind Connecticut, California, and New York. So it could be worse. Reporting live, I'm Shannon Perrin, Pittsburgh's Action News 4. Shannon, you and I never complain. Well, despite spending more at the pump than other states, Pennsylvania drivers are still saving. In 2014, drivers across the country saved a total $14 billion at the pump. That's about $115 per household, or nearly $44 for every single person in the country. And those savings are expected to skyrocket this year. This is according to the AAA. The Motor Club says American drivers could save between 50 and 75 billion dollars in 2015. That's up to 234 dollars per person, Mike. 